Another big story we are following tonight. Triad doctors are trying to figure out what happened to an 18 year old basketball player who went into cardiac arrest during a game. The scare happened at Winston Salem Christian School. Members on the basketball team used life saving strategies to help a student before emergency services arrived. WFMY News 2's Giselle Thomas spoke to the students involved. Dejan Blunt and some of his teammates were playing a practice pickup game similar to this one Sunday night. Now it was players only and no adults. He says that everything was fine until he went unresponsive and went down. We were like playing like a king of the court game. I, my teammate, we had finished the first set and then my teammate was um, talking to me and I just wasn't responding. A call for help turned into a quick response by fellow basketball players at Winston-Salem Christian. Everything in the gym just fell silent. And I was just like, oh, he's, he's not breathing anymore. Um, and I, I knew that if I waste any, would waste any time in asking if anyone knew CPR. The school hosts a basketball program with international students who use what they learned abroad to save a life. I checked if he's breathing. Uh, I saw that he's not. And then I started to perform CPR. It took me two rounds of CPR to get him back. And then we flipped him over again. And then I lost him again and then it took me about three minutes worth of CPR to, to get him just before the ambulance arrived. Blunt says since he got to the hospital, he's feeling better. I'm just grateful that I'm, that I'm still alive and still here. And, you know, today's my grandmother's birthday, so I'm glad that I'm able to spend the day with her. But the question remains, how does an 18-year-old go into cardiac arrest? Experts say children show different symptoms than adults. Any, you know, symptoms that happen with exercise. So if they have chest pain when they exercise, dizziness when they're exercising or passing out during exercising or kind of sometimes can be the first initial clues as there's maybe some sort of structural heart problem or a heart rhythm abnormality. She says teens should get sports physicals and when they do, they should never hold back information. Blunt tells me his doctors have not yet identified what caused the cardiac arrest. He also says he might have to spend another night at the hospital. Reporting in Winston-Salem, Giselle Thomas, WFMY News 2.